to our channel hope you all are doing good today in this video we are going to discuss about patterns okay you can see patterns everywhere patterns on your dresses patterns on walls patterns in things and patterns in numbers the first grade children are able to identify easily patterns in colors patterns in shapes patterns in things if you observe the heading you can see the patterns of shapes see here dot and star dot star dot so this is a pattern right so children are easily identifying these type of patterns but they are feeling difficulty in identifying the patterns of numbers so hope this video will be helpful for you to identify the patterns in numbers easily okay let's see few examples first of all before writing the answers you have to identify whether it is an increasing pattern or decreasing pattern got it so increasing means what small to big decreasing means big to small okay let's do few examples here we see few examples let's see the first one 2 4 6 8 what will be the next two numbers okay first the children should be able to identify whether it is an increasing order or decreasing order as i already told let's take the first two numbers the first number is small number and the next number is big number right 4 is bigger than 2 so 4 is big number so small to big means that is increasing order so we must count forward we must count forward numbers okay so first of all close your fingers let's start counting forward okay 2 after 3 Four, four is given, right? Four after five, six, six is given. That means it is increasing by two numbers. Okay. So let's see the last one. So eight after nine, ten. Ten after eleven, twelve. So this is easiest one. So the children can do this easy. Let's see the next one. Three and the next number is six. So how many numbers it is increasing? As first grade children are very small, they have to think little bit, right? So first close your fingers. Three after you have to count. First of all, this is increasing order or decreasing order? The first number is four. Six is bigger than three, so it is increasing order. Okay, so let's count three after four, five, six. So six is given here, so that it is increasing by three numbers. Okay, now let's count from twelve. Twelve after thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Fifteen after sixteen. Seventeen, eighteen. Is it easy or not, children? Yes. Next, eleven, and the next number is fifteen. Is bigger than eleven, so it is an increasing order. So let's count forward numbers from eleven. Okay. First, close your fingers. Eleven after twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fifteen. So, how many numbers it is increasing? Increasing by four numbers. Okay. So, twenty-three after twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven. Twenty-seven after twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one. So, we must follow the same pattern. Okay. Now. See the next numbers, twelve, and the next number is ten, eight, six, 
Now let's check the first two numbers. Here 12 is given and the next number is 10. So it is increasing or decreasing. The first number is bigger number and the second number is smaller number. Big to small it is decreasing order. So we must count backward numbers. Okay. So let's check. 12 before 11, 10. So it is decreasing by two numbers. So 6 before we must count backward numbers. 6 before 5, 4. 4 before 3, 2. So we must decrease by two numbers. Okay. Now let's check the next one. Okay. Next one is 24, 20, 16, 12. So let's check the first two numbers. 24 after what is given? 20. So the number are decreasing. Okay. Because the second number is smaller number than this. So the numbers are decreasing by how much? Let's count. Close your fingers. So decreasing means we must count backward numbers. Okay. So 24 before 23, 22, 21, 20 is given here. So it is decreasing by 4. So from 12 also we must count backward. Okay. 12 before 11, 10, 9, 8. Again 4. 8 before 7, 6, 5, 4. So let's practice backward numbers even so. So that you can easily do these patterns. Okay. Decreasing patterns. There will be no difficulty in that. 37, 32, 27, 22. So it is decreasing or increasing. The first number is bigger number than this. 32 is smaller number. Right. So big to small decreasing order. So we must count backward numbers. Okay. So how much? Let's close and start counting backward. 37 before 36, 35, 34, 33, 32. So how much? 5 numbers backward. Okay. So 22 before 21, 20, 19, 18, 17. 17 before, again take 5 fingers, 17 before, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12. Okay, is it clear? Now check the last one, 10, 20, 30. The first number is smaller one, next number is 20 is bigger than 10. So it is increasing order, right? So, we must count forward only. As it is easy one, 10, 20, 30, 40. The children can easily say next number is 50. That means it is increasing by 10 numbers. Okay. 50 after the 60. That's why the 10th place only changing. It is increasing by 10. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, so on. Okay. So, ho so, hope this video will be helpful for your children. So, start practicing and close your fingers and start counting forward when it is an increasing order. Count backward when it is decreasing order. Okay. See you soon. Thank you all of you. Bye-bye.